Oh, I, I should probably check out the artifact. Overload bow. Damage by fully drawn arrows disrupts combatants, stunning them, delaying ability regen, and lowering combatant damage output. Okay. Unstoppable pulse. I think you know which one I'm going to pick. Anti-barrier scout rifle. Are you kidding me, scout rifles? Ugh. I do, I do not want to have to use a scout rifle. I really do not want to have to use a scout rifle. Looks like I'm keeping Ariana's Val on me the whole season. Then we got Unstoppable Hand Cannon and Overload SMG. <sighs> Alright, well, let's go with Unstoppable Pulse. Just because. Scout and Sniper Targeting. Uh, scout Rifle Loader. Bow Dexterity. Sniper Rifle Dexterity. Sidearm Dexterity. What Sidearm Dexterity? Unflinching Scout Aim, Sniper Rifle Scavenger, Bow Reloader, Unflinching Sniper Aim, SMG Loader, Anti-Barrier Sniper, ooh, cool, Disrupting Blade, oh, that's cool, Resonant Siphon, gain Stasis Ability Energy whenever you or a member of your fire team stuns a champion, okay, Surge Detonators, uh, Arc Grenades Disrupt Combatants, Stunning Them, Delaying Ability Regen, and Lowering Combatant Damage Output, okay, and solar melee ability stunned on shielded combatants. All right, so Inferno Whip. Focusing Lens, your light abilities do bonus damage to combatants affected by stasis. What? I don't know, Passive Guard, receive less damage from combatants that are close to you while you're wielding a sword. Glacial Inheritance, defeating targets with your stasis super refunds super energy. Uh-oh. That may be a problem in PvP. That is probably going to be a problem in PvP. <laughs> but <laughs> it's a good mod. Sundering Glare. Rapid precision hits against distant combatants weaken, weaken them for a short time or duration. Volatile Conduction. Grant bonus arc super damage if cast while critically wounded. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. Like none of these none of these jump out at me is amazing. Uh, I mean I mean anti barrier sniper is definitely better than anti barrier scout rifle. Because and because scout rifles suck. Y you guys know my opinion about scout rifles by now. Like, if you don't, there's my opinion. Scout rifles suck. But Unstoppable Pulse will be my pick for the first one. Because, I mean, I like my pulse rifles. But I'm also going to... I'm also thinking maybe the next... Uh, my next artifact upgrade is probably going to be Overload Bow. Because, I mean, I mean bows have gotten better. I'm just saying. Bows definitely have gotten better. I need, to, I need to get some stuff out of my inventory. Uh, I think Fell Winters can... Fell Winters can go in the vault for a bit. Um, I'm going to get my Trinity Ghoul out. Just, be, uh, just because Trinity Ghoul is actually kind of good. Just... Yeah. Alright. So, what's up with the quest? Uh, okay. Meet Osiris and Crow near the war table. Eh. Okay. Oh, hey, Osiris. Hey. The new style suits you. Spoils of victory in the reef. Glint chose the materials. You haven't let me pay for any of this. If you want to repay me, keep that mask affixed to your face. It will protect you from the city's ignorance. I know what it's for. If this is what it takes to make a difference, I'm in. Don't. I've had to walk don't worry, Crow. Streets under disguise more times than you know. Hmm. Now I am welcome. Soon you shall be too. Patience and caution. Ah, Guardian. Hi. Saladin spoke highly of your assault. Really? They think their tank is a show of strength, but it is no iron door. Yeah. Saladin will hold the line so our attention can be directed elsewhere. Names are needed. Examples. My friends in the Reef have been talking. At this point, Red Legion commanders are either brutes or braggarts. Oh. Not the type for subtlety. They want Keitel's attention. We will use that information to direct our fury. Create a power vacuum and show the Cabal the path they've chosen. Dismissed. 
All right. Together in the field. Huh. I'm starting to get the impression you all like having me around. No. Who gave you that idea? The Umbral Decoder and Prismatic Recast have been appropriated by the Vanguard and relocated to the Helm. Visit the Umbral Decoder to obtain the Decrypting Darkness quest and then complete it. All right. Hey, I'm Bull Decoder. Guardian, when the Dark Fleet arrives, it changed many things, including engrams. Some of them now behave much differently than before. Crypt uh, the Cryptarchy needs your help in studying these changes. Of all the unlikely sources, it was the Drifter who first created a device for altering umbral engrams. Now the Cryptarchy is using his design as the basis for further research. We will provide you with the equipment for further research on these umbral engrams. In return, please help us by recording the results of your experiments. Tyra Karn. When the Black Fleet arrived, the Cryptarchy discovered that Umbral Engrams and Legendary Engrams are generated through similar processes. How or why the Engrams change is still a mystery. However, we now have a tool for controlling the, the contents of these Umbral Engrams. We call them Prismatic Lenses. The Drifter is yet to divulge how they're constructed, and truth told, it's possible he doesn't know either. Here's the final Prismatic Lens remaining from our previous studies. It's quite fragile, and we estimate it has a single charge left before it breaks. Take it along with this Umbral Engram and try the focusing process for yourself. Fragile Prismatic Lens. Okay. So what do we got? Umbral Affinity. Prismatic Lenses unlock the ability to focus Umbral Engrams and choose the rewards within. Fragile Prismatic Lens. Hmm. A focused Umbral Engram containing reforged weapons from the Red War. Okay. What did you give me? Wait, what do you give me from this? Tarantula? Genesis Dragonfly. Not amazing. Wait, not amazing. Alright. The focus of these Umbral Engrams remains a source of fascination. The potential applications are endless. I'm still wary of interacting so closely with the darkness, but we can no longer avoid it. Do you think the Dark Fleet is attempting to communicate through these lenses and engrams? There's still much to learn. Return to the helm with any prismatic lenses or umbral engrams, and let's continue our research together. All right. Thanks. So, Lord Saladin is waiting to brief you on the situation. Okay. Uh, I also got an emblem. Shadow Market. All right. So, I mean, that did not exactly give me the best results. Because, I mean, it's a linear fusion rifle. Linear fusion rifles are not good. Alright. What's this? Warriors of the Empire. Keitel. I see your fury. For years you have waited for your leaders to reclaim you. But time has not changed your nature. Your rage becomes the swing of the cleaver, the thrust of the shield, the shout of the cannon. I send out a challenge to the remains of the broken legion. Prove your worth in battle. The ancient rites live again. Huh. The triumphant will become the first members of my war council. We are Cabal. We eat the mountains. We drink the seas. Why would you want to drink the seas? That's That does not sound healthy. Alright. Saladin? The dragon of your light roars over Nessus. Our enemies fear you, Guardian. Oh. Really? Osiris mentioned you crashed a cabal ritual they call the Rite of Proving. Mm -hmm. He seems to think it's not unlike our crucible, made for settling scores. I don't see the resemblance. Me neither. Scraps of the Red Legion are competing to earn Keitel's favor. Just like her, their hands are tied by tradition. They're forced to meet every challenger or forfeit their position. We can exploit that. 
I want you to run down every Cabal commander you can find. If they're foolhardy enough to accept a fistfight with you, Keitel's War Council won't fill a single seat. <clears throat> to that end, Crow has spotted another of the Empress's hopefuls on Europa. They call him Basilius the Golem. He's looking for Golden Age relics to excavate from the ice. Okay. Basilius intends to augment his body and offer combat enhancements to other Cabal. Okay. If he succeeds, it won't be long before Keitel has an entire platoon of Exo Legionaries at her disposal. Get in the way. You got it. Europa holds a treasure trove of technological and paracausal assets. Right now, a Cabal commander named Basilius is skulking through the ice looking for anything he can find to present to the Empress. Saladin wants you to find him and disrupt his search by challenging him to combat. Either he fights you and dies, or he runs and dishonor does the rest. Okay! Battleground Hailstone. Oh, so I need, I need to get some reputation ranks. Unclaimed reputation awards will expire at the end of season 13. Cool. Cool. Oh, hey, look at this. <laughs> Successfully. Okay, I might as well pick up some bounties. Defeat combatants with bows. Uh, combatants in battlegrounds are worth more. Melee. Energy. Sweet. Okay, well. I mean, good news. I uh, Good news is, I have a good bow. Uh, I'll just. I'm going to switch over my heritage. I should probably get another rocket launcher. Um, I need a, uh, I need some space in my inventory. Um, this can go. I don't know why I have salvation's grip on me. I, I don't need it. I don't need it right now. I don't think. Let's just do this. Like I, th I think this will do. Just okay. So let's do the let's do the battleground. Battleground Hailstone. Actually, before I do that, let's go talk. Uh, wait, Bleak Watcher. And let's go. Uh, let's go talk to. Uh, let's go talk to Elsie really quickly. Back in a bit. All right. Well, first things first. I have. Uh, I have a hologram I didn't place here yet. It's from a. Uh, from my last little grind I had to do to get splintered. So yeah. Hey, Elsie. What's up? The stranger sights was the leaf upon your approach. It appears as usual that when it uh, when it comes to a secret to Clovis, there uh, there are always more hidden away. The old man was is rather nothing if not insanely overprotective. As such, we cannot access it without a potency of darkness energy. Fortunately for us, there's been a surge of just such an energy within the twisted caverns of the Vex here on Europa. Take the skeleton key and investigate the surge. If I'm right, it should give us what we need to unlock a further understanding of stasis. Investigate the appearance of entropic shards in the Well of Infinitude. Oh yeah, and there are also four fragments available. So I'm just gonna go ahead and grab a couple of fragment quests really quickly. Uh, let's see what I got. Collect dust slivers from rifle final blows, defeat frozen combatants, and defeat majors, ultras, and champions with stasis damage. Oh. Great. Great. Complete the list of objectives and strikes. Dark reflections have a chance to draw from defeated strike bosses. So, uh, wait, a chance? A chance to drop? Are you kidding? All right, what's the, uh, so slowed combatants defeated? Come on, man. Dark reflections collected, combatants frozen and defeated. Yeah, it's it's hard. Uh, it's much harder than you think to do just frozen. Well, uh, actually, just slowed. It's it's much harder to do just slowed with warlock. It's much easier to do that on hunter. Battleground Hailstone. Uh, I'll be back as soon as we load into that. All right, looks like we're loading in. Let's get uh, let's get this going. All right. Cabal forces are entrenched out here. You're in for a hell of a firefight before we can breach their defenses. Those command carriers are likely to send reinforcements, but I'll try to draw their air support away. All right. That should buy me enough time to take down the barrier that's blocking the way forward. You got it, Crow. Uh, I mean, uh, I mean, sure, every, uh, sure, everyone's like everyone's using the new bow, but I mean, this is the like Trinity. Uh, Trinity Ghoul is still like insanely good. So, 
Wow! Yeah, this. Yeah, this is. Uh, this is just as good as I remember. I like. Uh, I like it. Oh. Hi. Okay. Huh. That didn't do as. That didn't do as good as I thought it would. Okay. Give me that. Two more rockets. Sweet. Hello? Oh, here we go. Hmm. Well, I didn't... I didn't do what I thought it would. Are you kidding me? Here we go. Wait, did... Okay, these, these legendary engrams are, are giving me weapons that are going to sunset at the end of this season. Cool. Love it. Okay, yeah, Heritage. Uh, Heritage is still pretty good, I will say. Like, okay. Got any more uh, heavy ammo anywhere? I would like, I would like some more rockets. Hmm. Are you kidding, dude? There we go. I need it. I need to not suck. Just let me hit. Uh, let me hit some. Uh, uh, let me hit some arrows, okay? Oh, hi. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Armed with the elements. Nice. Are you kidding? Arcus and Sa uh, Sajida. What? Hmm. I don't know if I'm rounds that correctly, but it's whatever. It's fine. Press the advance. Yep. Just keep on going down this way. Oh, nice! <laughs> it's not every day you can get your uh, uh, sparrow somewhere where uh, it can't go. Or it's not supposed to go. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Hit! There we go. Really? Ooh. Sorry. Wait, sorry about this. Like, Trinity Ghoul is uh, Trinity Ghoul is act actually like freaking amazing. So yeah. There we go. Oh jeez. Hey! There we go. It's it oh my god, <laughs> dude. Are you kidding? That sucks. That really sucks. Can I grab more heavy? Nope. Should have freaking figured I can't grab more heavy. Oh my gosh. Go away. Okay. Yeah. That's good. Oh my gosh! I still love Journey to Ghoul with that. This is a this is with the catalyst, by the way. Without the catalyst, it's actually kind of meh. Oh jeez, nope. Reload. What the heck? Oh jeez. Let's go. Barriers down. Get a move on. That's what I'm doing right now. The cabal got sloppy. Vex had moved in behind them. Watch your back or you'll get caught in the crossfire. Oh, great. The Vex are going to be here as well. Lovely. Okay. We can get any... Oh, Vex up here. Okay. I don't want to. I don't want to waste my rockets on uh, on Vex. I think. I think the seasonal challenge was to do Cabal. I want to say Cabal. All right. Go away. All right. 
You know, buddy, you could slow down just a little bit. Like, I know you're a shadow, but that gives you no excuse to go fast. But yeah, once again, um, once again, this is, uh, the Trinity Equal is uh, only really good with the Catalyst. If you don't have the Catalyst, it's just, it's just meh. Again, you can slow down, buddy. And I don't have... Your commander should be up ahead. Give him what for? Kindly remind him they don't belong on Europa. Mm, I'd skip the kindly part. <laughs> I'd skip the kindly part. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I like, I like that. I, yeah, I'd skip the kindly part as well, just... <laughs> oh my gosh. That didn't work. Uh, I, I need... Uh, I need some... I need some Cabal to group together. Huh. And I need to... I need to stay away from these guys when I have... Uh, when I have Reactive Pulse on... Like... Oh my god. Reactive Pulse is messing up... Uh, messing up, like, all of my builds. It's just been messing up all my builds recently, like... Jeez. Oh, There's, a uh, Oh. Honor Centurion up there. There we go. Really? Okay, get wet. There we go. Sorry, buddy. Kind of trying to get some bow kills here. This is the... actually, I don't even know if the bow bounty I have is is done. It might be. Okay. Dude, this th this thing's got uh, this thing's got some damage to it. Man, oh my! Can you? Yep. Okay. Hammer of Proving. The Cabal searching for the secrets of the Deep Stone Crypt. I don't understand wanting to become a machine. To lose everything you are. What sort of person is willing to do that to themselves? From what I gather, folks becoming exos weren't always willing. Really? And here I thought the people of the Golden Age were supposed to be enlightened. Let the Cabal feel the same way about themselves. The way you talk about the Cabal, others talk the same way about the Elixni, especially in the Tower. Shax openly jokes about killing them. Some Guardians wear their bones on their armor like they're animals. It's different when you walked among them, shared a meal with them. Well, I ain't gonna be sharing a meal with no Cabal anytime soon. Agreed. Uh... I'm just gonna get out of here. So what's up? Oh, looks like uh, okay. So I just need melee damage. Okay, okay. I I know about that. Return to the helm and visit the war table to investigate the ceremonial ceremonial hammer you found. Wow, I cannot talk. All right, uh, back to the helm and I'll be right back. All right. So what's up with this hammer? As you approach the table, you notice a ceremonial hammer retrieved from your last mission. A warm, a glowing, a warm golden light radiates out from the mouth and eyes of the cabal face sculpted in one head of the hammer, as though a fire burns inside. It was an offering, Osiris says from behind you, from the Red Legion to Keitel. The Cryptarchs can provide more nuance about its history, but what matters is its purpose. A symbol of cabal culture, power, entitlement. One you now wield. Osiris spreads his hands and says, Master the hammer and forge yourself a path to victory. Forge challenger medallions from Cabal Gold to challenge Keitel's chosen warriors in the battlegrounds. The hammer must be equipped to acquire Cabal Gold. What do you mean? What do you mean it has to be equipped? What do we got? Wield the hammer of proving to pillage Cabal Gold by collecting, uh, completing playlist strikes, gambit, crucible, public events, dungeons, nightmare hunts, or blind well. The hammer of proving permits challenges of honorable combat to be issued, skirting the risk of total war with the Cabal. However, to be recognized as legitimate, it must be socketed with Cabal Gold. So you need 14 Cabal Gold. Okay. I can do that. 
But uh, I think I think I'm gonna call it for this episode of Destiny 2. I just I just wanted to get a little bit of an introduction to how the season is going to go. And also, um, can I still get large charges? Yeah, I think I'm still getting large charges, which is which is good because I'm still trying to I'm still trying to find a deafening whisper. But yeah. Alrighty, guys, that'll do it for this episode of Destiny 2. I hope you guys enjoyed the intro to Season of the Chosen. Stay tuned next time. We're probably going to do some... I don't know. I don't know what we're going to do, but we're, we're going to be playing Destiny, so that'll be a good time. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Later!